one word. Yuck. Hey guys, welcome back to Possum TV. Well, 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 can't believe it's already Sunday. But today I am gonna do a Q&A kind of question video. I haven't done like a Q&A in like the longest time, but instead of having you guys ask me questions, well, you guys are asking me questions, but it's actually, I posted on Instagram and I told Paul fans to ask me a weird or strange question. Why? I'm not sure. I think it's because Paul fans are so creative and I can't wait to read the questions that you guys have that are super weird and super strange and attempt to answer them. All right, guys, without further ado, let's dive right into the video. By the way, if you don't follow me on Instagram at Possum TV, you need to follow me because we are the Paul family and we are cool and it's super fun. And yeah, just follow me subscribe to my channel and thanks for being a paw fan okay this paw fan asked me where is your toilet it's kind of a strange question to ask because i don't think anyone has ever asked anyone where's your toilet oh maybe when you go to someone's house and you're like hey where's the bathroom or where's the toilet but my toilet is in a special place it's in the bathroom good one the next question is, do you like bananas? I love bananas, but that's not a stranger word question. Come on, Paul fans, you can do better than this. Ask me some juicy, weird, or strange questions. Okay, this Paul fan said, what do you think about frosting on pickles? One word, yuck. Actually, hmm, let me think about it. The combination sounds kind of weird because pickles are sour and frosting is sweet. I don't know, Paw fan. If I had that, I'd probably eat all the frosting first and then eat the pickle. But I wouldn't eat it together. Ew, that's kind of like a sour, sweet kind of flavor. I don't know. But then again, I also eat weird stuff. I like eat french fries with ice cream. So... Paw fans, has anyone ever tried frosting on pickles? Let me know in the comments below. I'm kind of scared to try it and I don't know if I want to try it though. Oh, this paw fan has a good one. How many chicken nuggets dance in your room? Oh my dog. Well, first of all, chicken nuggets dancing is kind of weird. And how many of them are dancing in my room? They are i don't know i don't know how to answer that that is such a weird question good job paw fan yeah i mean can you imagine chicken nuggets with like arms and legs and they're just like dancing and having fun in your room no they belong in the tummy okay in the tummy Ooh, we got some food questions okay the next one is have you ever tried cheeto puffs and mayo like mayonnaise yeah no. Well, first of all, I don't really eat Cheetos. I can't eat hot Cheetos because it's too spicy for me. But I don't really like Cheeto puffs. I don't know. I don't usually eat a lot of Cheetos, but Cheetos and mayonnaise? Yuck. But I mean, who knows? You know, I shouldn't be judging because maybe it's a really good combination. Comment down below and let me know if you've tried Cheeto or Cheeto puffs and mayo the combination seems weird but then again i really like ranch and isn't ranch made out of mayo yeah i don't know i don't know but good one good one okay the next question is is a pig and a short hair lps a good couple that is is that a stranger word question because i think any couple you want to put together are a good couple because we don't discriminate here on this channel we love everyone and no matter what if you think it's a good couple, it's a good couple. The next question is, what's the grossest or weirdest thing you did when you were little? Uh, I don't know. I didn't really do weird or gross things when I was little. At least I don't think so. But I don't think I did. I was just semi-normal, I guess. I'm trying to think if there's anything gross that... Oh, I used to bite my nails. That's kind of gross. Like when I was a kid, I used to bite my nails and some people still bite their nails. You know, it's kind of like a habit. I think that's kind of gross now because I'm a germaphobe now. Yuck. But back in the day, yep, your girl, I bit the nails. I bite the nails. And the reason I stopped is because one of my teachers yelled at me and called me a baby. And then I cried. And then ever since then, I stopped biting my nails. Yep, she was mean. But hey, she helped me 
Stop biting my nails, I guess. All right, another semi food question. Have you ever drank popsicle juice? Um, first of all, popsicle juice sounds weird, but when I think about it, like if I'm eating a popsicle and it melts, isn't that the popsicle juice? I don't know how many of you guys have tried icy or otter pops, but is that considered a popsicle? I don't know. I, I consider it a popsicle, but when it melts and you drink it, mm hmm. That thing tastes good. Okay, this is weird, but it's good. So this one says, does ants have feelings? Girl, I have no clue, but I think so. I don't know. It's an insect. It's living. I mean, pets have feelings, so maybe ants do too. I don't know. You let me know in the comments below if ants have feelings. All right, guys, this is the last one I'm going to answer. And this one's weird and I don't know how to answer it. So maybe you guys can help me because you guys are creative. But the question is, if an avocado and a kiwi got together, what would be their ship name? Avocado and kiwi. Um, avo kiwi or kiavo? Ooh, kiavo. I like that. Actually, I don't know. Maybe you guys can come up with better names, but yeah, Kiavo is the best I can come with. That's their ship name. We're going to be shipping fruits on this channel now. Well, anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed that. Well, kind of funny and weird and strange question thingy. I don't know. I just thought about it and I was like, it will be fun or funner than actually like a regular Q&A. But if you want me to do a Q&A, let me know in the comments below and I'll probably do another one too. But yeah, follow me, subscribe to me, love me, I love you and stay possum guys. Love you guys so much. Bye.